by the ongoing drug supply reduction. And proper disposal of single-use uh, plastics and responsible actions towards the ocean are crucial for conserving and uh, protecting the marine environment. This was a key point of discussion at a symposium marking the World Oceans Day. Correspondent Esther Mopariola reports. Recent studies indicate that oceans worldwide have reached record high temperatures a concerning trend for the planet's health. Oceans produce half of the world's oxygen and drive weather patterns. However, warmer oceans mean more carbon dioxide remains in the atmosphere, accelerating global warming. To highlight the importance of oceans, the United Nations designated June the 8th as World Oceans Day. Our responsibility in Lagos, Environmental advocates organized a symposium to raise awareness and promote climate action for ocean protection. Trying to be speaking more to the younger generation so that we can start, we hope that we can get them to have a change of mindset at a very early stage. Everything that is happening to us today is mostly man-made. We have to be very disciplined citizens, um, disciplined in the sense that we should stop um, polluting and throwing waste on our waterways, our drainage systems and our, our canals. With that, we'll definitely be able to address some of the climate issues with over flooding and erosion that we're currently suffering as a nation. Addressing the issue of sea incursions along coastlines, Director General of the Nigerian Conservation Foundation emphasizes that tackling this environmental challenge requires more than just political will. The mangrove ecosystem breaks the current and then makes everything to go smoothly. But when we tamper as humans, we tamper with the, uh, with the mangrove ecosystem, then we start experiencing erosion. Now we are rushing to put a brown infrastructure to be able to make sure that doesn't happen. But that brown infrastructure will not be as effective as uh, the green infrastructure that nature had put in place. So for us to be able to really uh, make sure it uh, works, we to intervene, we have to put a lot of money in it. The coastal road provides an opportunity for us to have an integrated coastal management system where we'll be able to not just construct the road, but also integrate the management of the coastal erosion to that construction. With increased awareness and joint actions towards responsible plastic disposal and ocean conservation, we can ensure a healthier, more sustainable marine environment for future generations. Estamo Pariola, TVC News. Well, that's it on TVC News at 1. For more updates on the stories we are monitoring, you can visit our website on www.tvcnews.tv. You can also follow us on our social media handles, Facebook, Instagram, and on X at TVC News NG. On YouTube, we are live at TVC News Nigeria.